Here he is, DRS, the Alfa Romeo. And for start, it's disappointing. But for start, I mean, he's only a wee bit behind, but you'd, you'd still expect better. Perez is warming up his tyre, so we'll just give a wee simulation up to our next lap. I mean, from 15th to 10th, it's pretty close. It's five temps, and you get two temps covering the top four, or less than a temp covering the top three, whatever way you want to look at it. But we're sending our cars out now, and this is where things are going to get tasty. Who is going to get pole position here at the Australian Grand Prix? Can Ferrari remain on top? Hopefully, that would be the dream. But as you can see, we're flying now. For starting, we'll be last across that line. Alonso is the first. Oh, no, he's not the first, actually, the bunch, but... Who is the first? It's that man, Lewis Hamilton. What can Lewis Hamilton do in the final moments here? A Q3. Can he get amongst the top four cars? Probably not, but he'll be looking to cement fifth place and hopefully be in a good position for the rest of the race. Tell you what, though, he did a good job in Barry to get that podium. He truly did. Because I thought he had no chance, but you know what? He turned that around now, Lewis, like he normally does. But Hamilton towards the line. What's it going to be now for Lewis Hamilton? He doesn't improve. Perez now. I see, wait, there's a fucking Ferrari. It's Leclerc. Doesn't improve. Perez doesn't improve. Seems to be a, a familiar tale here, but it's Carlos Sainz to the line. Doesn't improve. It's